Today my uh, goal is to fly my drone uh, up a couple hundred feet and have it follow me on my e-bike. And when I say follow me, I mean actually not physically go down the road with me. I'm going to just take it up a couple hundred feet or so and let the gimbal and the camera just follow me and let the drone just pivot as it needs to just, just for fun. So I'm using the Maven app and I'm going to take off here in a second. There we go. I've got my controller strapped to the bag on the back rack of my e-bike. Okay, I'm going to go up a couple hundred feet just so it can kind of see me. There we go, that's about good enough. Pull it down a little bit so I can uh, hit the focus button, so I'll try to make sure it's in focus. We'll hit the three dots here and go to the co-pilot mode. I'm gonna click on the little man, which is me. We'll click on the uh, rotation of the drone, let it rotate back and forth in order to follow me on my bike. And we'll tick click on the uh, gimbal tilt and uh, I'm gonna hit record on the drone and I think I'm ready we'll give it a shot and see if it works turn on my bike And let's go nice and easy through the neighborhood. And I won't be able to tell if it's following me while I'm riding my bike. But you will as you're uh, watching the video, of course. And I will once I get the video back. Forgot to wave at the neighbor. All right. Now again, it's not supposed to, <clears throat> excuse me, it's not supposed to physically follow me. It's just supposed to camera track me only. Going about 20 miles an hour. <clears throat> Hopefully you're seeing me go down the road. I wish there was a way for me to be able to tell if it was following me or not, but I don't have any way of mounting my remote to my drone on my handlebars yet. That's probably next. I'm going to go down here to the stop sign. Hopefully it's still tracking me. There's a lot of wind in my face, but uh, hopefully you can hear me. I'm probably about a quarter of a mile from my house or so, a little further. I'll just go down here and turn around. Now the drone probably can't physically see me right now because of the trees and different things like that. But hopefully it's still tracking me based on the signal from my drone's remote control, which is strapped to my bicycle. I'm going to wave and see if it actually shows up on video, if it is working and watching me. My wife asked me what I was doing. I tried to explain it to her and she said, never mind, go have fun. And then she asked me, what was the purpose of me doing this? And I said, well, I'm retired and I'm doing it because I can. 
I mean, I have an instant 360 camera that I like to play with. I have a DJI Mavic 2 Zoom I like to play with. And I absolutely love my e-bike. It's a wired cruiser, it's called Blue. It's a class two e-bike, so it's legal in Texas. You can, of course, change the settings to make it go faster if you're gonna be on private property or off-road. Right now I'm doing 20.2 miles an hour on a street that's parallel to mine. Coming up to the stop sign. I just want this to be a short little video just for, uh, for the fun of it. My wife actually likes when I do these little things because in the evening it puts me back uh, in my own computer room, I call it, study. I get to play with the videos, mesh them together, post them on YouTube. It keeps me out of the living room where uh, she can watch her uh, shows, shows she likes to do. So anything that gets me out of the house and lets her watch the show she wants or in another room she likes. All right, I'm here. Hopefully it worked. I will uh, land the drone here shortly and uh, we'll see what the video looks like. Thanks for watching.